my YouTube channel, The Magic of Maths by Rumani. Today, I have got a very interesting topic for you. That is the conceptual clarity between the 2D and the 3D shapes. Normally, what I saw in students is that in class 6th or 7th, when we start with the chapter visualizing the solid shapes and I normally show this shape to the students, then I ask them which shape is this, they answer it as a square. And when I show this shape to the students and ask that which shape is this, they answer it as a triangle. But students, these are 3D solids. These are 3D shapes which occupy space. They have three dimensions. It is not a square. It is not a triangle. So in this video, I'm going to make you visualize. Aapko mein dikhaungi, visualize karwaungi ki 2D shapes or 3D shapes mein kya difference hota hai. So let's begin with our video. So let's begin with our topic. That is the conceptual clarity between the 2D and the 3D shapes. For this, first of all, you need to understand the definition of a plane. Ki beta plane kya hota hai? In mathematics, geometry mein, plane word is used for a flat surface which has two dimensions, that is length and breadth. For example, you can see in front of you, ye ek plane surface hai. It extends indefinitely. Iski koi bhi length fixed nahi hoti. But it has no thickness. Iski koi thickness nahi hoti. But it extends indefinitely. Both lengthwise and breadthwise. For example, you can see an example of plane in front of you. Normal if I take a piece of paper. This is also an example of plane surface. And jo shapes hum plane surface ke upar bina dete hai. Unko plane figures ya flat shapes bolte So first of all starting with a very easy plane flat shape that is a 2D shape having three sides and that is a triangle. As you all can see this is a triangle having three sides and three vertices. So I place this on a plane. So the next 3D shape having four sides and four vertices that is four sides and four vertices and this is known as a square. This we have done in smaller classes. In primary also we do. That is the 2D shapes having different sides and different number of vertices. Again there is this 2D shape which we do in smaller classes. It also has four sides and four vertices but the difference you can see between rectangle and square is that in rectangle opposite sides are equal but in square all the four sides are equal I place this 2D shape over here if you see clearly these 2D shapes are transparent and you can see the base so it gives you the idea for the perimeter and area which I'll be teaching you in the next video that what is the difference between perimeter and area this 2D shape Having five sides is known as a pentagon. So I place this over here. You can place it anywhere randomly. So basically I am showing you all the 2D shapes having different number of sides and different number of vertices. This is again a 2D shape having six sides and six vertices. And we all know that it is known as a hexagon. So these are different types of 2D shapes which I have shown you and I have placed it on a plane. In sabko mene plane surface ke upar rakha hai. Now from these 2D shapes, from this TLM, I'll take you to the world of 3D. Ki humne ab 3D shapes dekhni hai. Ye sabhi jo humne kari 2D shapes hain, jisko hum ek plane surface, flat surface ke upar rakh sakte hai. Aur inki do dimensions hoti hai. That is length and breadth. Now we will move to 3D shapes and we will see that 3D shapes have three dimensions from this TLM only. So moving on to the world of 3D shapes. Beta ye wohi base hai which I used to explain the 2D shapes. I have converted it into different form. And you can see that from this corner we have three lines coming up. This one represents the X axis. This represents the Y axis. And this represents the Z axis. Or ye setup maine use kiya to explain the 3D shapes because 3D shapes have three dimensions. X axis represents the length, Y axis represents the breadth 
एंड जेड एक्सेस रिप्रेजेंट दी हाइट सो इससे आपको थ्री डी शेप बिल्कुल क्लियर हो जाएंगी बेटा सो द फर्स्ट थ्री डी शेप दैट आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू इज अ क्यूब दिस क्यूब हैज सिक्स स्क्वेर फ्लैट फेसेस आपको दिख रहा है ये जो सामने है दिस इज अ फेस एंड दिस इज द शेप ऑफ अ स्क्वेर एंड कितने स्क्वेर फेसेस है इसके वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव एंड सिक्स एंड द लाइन वेर द टू फेसेस मीट अब देखो ये दो फेसेस इस लाइन पे मिल रहे हैं द रेड लाइन विच यू कैन सी दीज आर नोन एज दी एजेस अगर हम इसकी एजेस काउंट करें यू कैन सी फोर एजेस ऑन द टॉप फोर एट बॉटम फोर एंड फोर एट एंड फोर स्टैंडिंग लाइन सो टोटल वी हैव ट्वेल्व एजेस एंड द पॉइंट वेर द थ्री एजेस मीट इज नोन एज अ वर्टेक्स तो यहां पे तीन एजेस मिल रही हैं तो इस पॉइंट को हम बोलते हैं वर्टेक्स सो हाउ मेनी वर्टेस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एंड एट सो अ क्यूब हैज सिक्स फेसेस ट्वेल्व एजेस एंड एट वर्टेस एंड आई प्लेस इट ओवर हेयर एंड इफ यू सी इट वेरी क्लियरली द डायमेंशन अलोंग द लेंथ ब्रेथ एंड हाइट आर फोर यूनिट्स ईच बेटा इसकी सारी डायमेंशन तीनों ही इक्वल हैं तो इसको हम साइड बोलते हैं इसकी जो साइड है दैट इज फोर यूनिट्स बिकॉज एक्स एक्सिस पे भी वाई एक्सिस पे भी जेड एक्सिस पे भी इट हैज फोर यूनिट्स सो मूविंग ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट थ्री डी शेप दैट इज अ क्यूबॉइड अ क्यूबॉइड हैज बेटा रेक्टेंगुलर फेसेस इसके जो फेसेस होते हैं वो रेक्टेंगल शेप होते हैं इसकी भी काउंटिंग ऑफ नंबर ऑफ फेसेस वर्टिस एंड एजेस रिमेन्स द सेम दैट इज इट हैज सिक्स फेसेस ट्वेल्व एजेस एंड एट वर्टिस बट वेन आई प्लेस इट ओवर हेयर यू विल सी द डिफरेंस बिटवीन अ क्यूब एंड अ क्यूबॉइड आई विल टेक यू क्लोजर यू सी अलॉन्ग एक्स एक्सिस इट हैज फाइव यूनिट्स अलॉन्ग वाई एक्सिस इट हैज थ्री यूनिट्स एंड अलॉन्ग जेड एक्सिस इट हैज फोर यूनिट्स सो लेंथ इज फाइव यूनिट्स ब्रेथ इज थ्री and height is 4 units so you can easily see the difference between a cube and a cuboid a cube has all six square faces and this cuboid has rectangular faces so students these are the two 3d shapes the next 3d shape that i am going to show you is a prism this is a rectangular prism having three rectangular faces and two triangular faces total iske five faces hote hain beta and the number of vertices 1 2 3 4 and 5 6 total vertices are 6 faces are 5 and if you'll count the black lines iski black lines agar aap count karoge they come out to be 9 so total 9 edges 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 8 and 9 total 9 edges this is known as a prism this is a prism students The next one I'm going to show you is a pyramid. This is a very common shape, and this we have heard in even the pyramids of Egypt, है ना? So this is a pyramid having four triangular faces. इसकी जो base है बेटा वो भी triangle है और ऊपर जो सारे जा रहे हैं faces वो भी triangle है. So it has one, two, three and four faces, and vertices one, two, three and four. Four vertices and edges. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six edges, four vertices, four faces, and six edges. And this is known as a triangular pyramid. ठीक है बेटा. So moving on to the last three D shape, that is a pyramid again. But this one is a square pyramid in which the base is a square shape. Let's count its faces, vertices, and edges. It has five faces: one, two, three, four, and five. Four are triangular first faces, beta, and one is the square face. And the vertices are also five: one, two, three, four, and five. So five faces, five vertices, and if we we'll count the edges, that is these lines, they come out to be eight. So five faces, five vertices, and eight edges. So this is a square pyramid. So students, you can easily see. that is a cube cuboid a prism a triangular pyramid and a square pyramid and now i'll place the 
2D shapes in front of you. That is, this is a square. This is a triangle. This is a rectangle. This is a hexagon meter. And this one is a pentagon. So you can visualize and see the difference between the 2D shapes and the 3D shapes. They all are in front of you. And you can very clearly see the difference between the 2D shapes and 3D shapes. Mein kya difference hota hai. So never answer a cube as a square or cuboid as a rectangle. So I hope you like this video. Share it students as much as you can. Thank you and have a nice day.